Hi guys, it's Kiwi Simming here, and welcome back to my channel for another room build in The Sims 4. Another very echoey uh, voiceover. Holy shit, I really need to get some more furniture in this room. Sorry, it's like, oh. If it's annoying me, it's probably annoying you, but then again, I get annoyed by like literally everything, so maybe it's not annoying you, and just me talking about the constant echo is annoying you. If that's the case, hey, sorry, you know. <laughs> I'm a complainer, I feel like we all know this by now. But anyway, today we are doing a kitchen room build. I've called this an eccentric or eccentric. Alex tells me it's eccentric, but I'm pretty sure it's eccentric. Like, tell me who's right. Is it eccentric, like I think it is, or is it eccentric, like Alex thinks it is? Because I don't know. I I think I'm right, but Alex thinks he's right. So someone tell me who's right. Um, actually, if I'm wrong, just tell me that I'm right anyway, because, you know, I boost my ego and shit. But yeah, we're doing like a very eccentric, colorful, kitchen yep i don't really know where i got the idea to do this i was just kind of looking at like the movie hangout stuff i feel like that's my favorite stuff pack i used to i don't know when i first got the movie stuff out pack i was kind of like stuff out <laughs> the movie hangout stuff stuff pack god i don't know when i first got it i was just kind of like Ugh. but um yeah i'm kind of obsessed with it and i'm pretty sure it's my favorite pack now so yeah sorry for like shitting on you in my mind to begin with movie stuff out nope that's not it movie <laughs> stuff uh, help me but um no i'm obsessed with it now i really like it so yeah i was looking at like the rug you see this rug right here i was like i want to do a room and i kind of want to like base it around the colors of this rug so that's what i did and i called it eccentric although like when I think of eccentric personally, I think of like orange and yellow and shit, but like this is purple and pink. So maybe it's not 100% eccentric, but like when do my titles actually match the theme of what I'm building? <laughs> Never. So, yep, sorry for the inaccurate title. Maybe we can call this clickbait. <laughs> I don't know, it's still kind of eccentric. It's just not like, not the eccentric that I can imagine. You know what I mean? I don't know. I'm just an idiot. But um, yeah, so that's what we're doing today, by the way. <laughs> Um, oh god, I'm so cold. It doesn't matter. I'm not going to talk about being cold in this video because, ah, uh, okay. <laughs> I'm working, oh, I have work later today, and I'm working six days this week. I'm so tired, okay? My ankles are really sore, like it hurts to walk, and to, like, in order to do my job, I walk fast. Like, okay, I'm the fastest worker in my department, like, praise me on that. My speed efficiency is like 200%. It needs to be at 100% at the bare minimum. I'm double that, fam. Like, listen, I am Speedy Gonzalez. No one can ever pass me, all right? This one girl hates me, I'm pretty sure, at work because I'm faster than her. And she used to be the fastest, but now I'm the fastest. And so she can't stand it. She's very competitive. But yeah, it's funny. Anyway, what was I talking about? Oh, uh, yeah. So, like, I have to walk. Well, I don't have to walk, but I do walk fast when I'm working and it's like, it's like my shin that is absolutely aching. It's like, just every time I take a step, my, honestly, my foot feels like it's going to fall off. And like, of course this will happen. Honestly, I walk fast every single time I'm working and like, usually I'm fine. But the one time I'm working six days in a row, it's, it hurts and I need a day off, you know? <laughs> Oh, I'm in so much pain, but it's fine. Uh, six day working weeks are great. I mean, I love only having one day off. <laughs> no, but the money will be good, so I'm not going to complain about it too much. I mean, I'm not complaining about the work. I'm just complaining about being in pain. Like, I'd be fine working the six days if I wasn't in pain. So, yeah, that's cool. Sorry for making this commentary a little bit depressing and talking about being in pain because, like, <laughs> ugh, I don't know. I just... I'm home alone right now and like okay being home alone when I was at my parents house it was like kind of I don't know it just still felt like I wasn't alone because it was my parents house I don't know how that works but it was just a thing but when I'm home alone here in my house when it's just me and Alex living here in general and like it's just me home it feels so weird like it's so I don't know I just yeah I'm still like adjusting to <laughs> living without my parents around um or like not even just my parents I'm just adjusting to not having so many people living with me um I do love it I will say that it is so nice not like having to work around other people and not having to wait to do filming until other people shut up and all this kind of thing like that part is great it's just so weird like I don't know <laughs> I'm not used to it just yet but yeah um, it's going good though. I don't really think I've spoken about the move that much. 
actually who am I kidding I've mentioned it in every video but like I haven't spoken about how like it's how it's gone and all that stuff we've settled in so that's good uh, we got internet and TV connected uh, yesterday when I'm filming this commentary but it'll be like <laughs> a week ago a week ago by the time this video goes up actually exactly a week I think yeah I'm pretty sure this is scheduled to go up next Friday so yes exactly a week from now um, yeah so that's good um, as soon as we got the TV and the internet set up it instantly felt so much more like home yeah it just like it, it felt like home but at the same time it kind of didn't it just felt like a I don't know just a shell with like a bit of furniture in it but like I don't know why the TV made such a difference just having access to like watching TV whenever I feel like it has just made it feel so much more homely and I love it it's a good time but yeah we are almost finished with this kitchen also I forgot to mention that it includes a dining area but you probably kind of already figured that one out because it's right there <laughs> I don't know I feel like if I was like in order to do a room build that includes or like a, a room build solely around a kitchen you kind of have to put a dining room in as well otherwise it's just too small a build I don't know maybe that's just me but yep we are just putting in some lights and then I think we're going to jump into some screenshots. Sorry this video moved so slow by the way. I don't really know why I didn't speed it up more. But anyway, <laughs> we have jumped into some screenshots. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. This is up on the gallery. My origin ID is Kiwi Swimming, And of course, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.